hello and welcome back to my channel and so we are still working on the detailing of the reinforced concrete slab and we had earlier worked on the main reinforcements so before we go on i'd like you to share this video after it's completed and i would also like you to click the subscribe button and you can also comment on the episode and so let's look at a few things we need to make some corrections um earlier we talked about the type of bending moment diagram we may likely have here actually that explanation was meant for a scenario where we have cantilevers so what it means is that this drawing should have its bending moments especially let's assume for this part it should start from here and then go and then we have it moving this way and then it ends here so that means that the bending moment at the support should be zero however we need to understand that the bending moment at the uh, beams or the supports will require a reinforcement, a top bar to be placed at all the uh, beams. So this should span. So if we have one here, it should span from this point to this point. And the same thing applies to the rest. And then the other thing we need to adjust is that, for instance, earlier we met, we discussed about this and the according to um, BSC two one zero, it's actually the return should be about one quarter and not one third so we should take note of that and then um what it also means is that the top bars the top distribution bar in this case should have reinforcements it should have reinforcements both ways so while you're having while you're having the top bar coming out this way, you should also have the horizontal components coming this way. So that's something else we should uh, remember. And um, we may still come back to design those things, but because of time, let's look at this, this panel and then this panel. Now, what I'm going to say here is that if you look at this panel, it's a one-way slab. And so, if we are going to introduce the main reinforcement, it is going to be parallel to the shorter side. Now, what happens is that this reinforcement, there is something else I need to mention here. This uh, reinforcement, they should also be you know for sake of bonding it should also extend into the next or neighboring panel, um, panels and so <clears throat> if i'm going to introduce a reinforcement bar here for this what i'm going to have is that i may let me use the so let's use um, main bars so uh, so we may have a scenario like this so um this should Let's lengthen it a little bit.
Oh, let's take it back, sorry.